If you or your partner get a payment from Centrelink, like JobSeeker payment, youth allowance, special benefit, parenting payment, carers payment, disability support pension or age pension, you need to tell us when something changes. If the only payment you get is family tax benefit or childcare subsidy, the rules are a little different for these payments. You'll still need to tell us about changes to your circumstances, and we have a separate video you can watch which will explain how to update your income estimate for these payments. You need to tell us about changes to your circumstances within 14 days. If you don't, we may pay you too much, which could result in a debt. It could also result in Centrelink not paying you enough. Examples of changes you need to tell us about include your personal and contact details or bank details, your relationship status, for example if you become partnered or separated, the care arrangements for anyone in your care, including your children, your accommodation details, including changes to your address, who you live with or how much rent you pay, your Australian visa or residence status, your or your partner's work, including starting or stopping work and changes to your work hours or pay, your or your partner's income or assets, including if you get a lump sum payment, if you're leaving the country, temporarily or permanently. For some payments, you also need to tell us about changes to your study, including your study load and changes in your medical condition. You can tell us about a change in your circumstances using self-service. You can use your Centrelink online account through MyGov, the Express Plus Centrelink mobile app or Centrelink phone self-service. If you can't use a self-service option, you can call us to tell us about the changes. You can find more information at servicesaustralia.gov.au.